The following contest is a tables match. Making his way to the ring, representing the good guys from the United States of America, weighing in at 220 pounds, Lightning. Guys, this match has the potential to completely change the WWE landscape, and it's because of this level of talent involved. The look of focus and determination on his face. He wants to show the world that he can compete on this high level. And his opponent from Norwich, England, weighing in at 219 pounds, Thomas. The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. He's been demanding this match for quite some time, and now he is ready to compete. People have to remember, Michael, in a tables match, it doesn't matter what table you put your opponent through, including our Table. Don't say that too loud, Corey. I prefer to keep our working area clear. Thank you very much. Well, wait a minute. Since when does what we prefer matter to these superstars? Actually, Byron, that was a good point. Bottom line is one way or another, somebody's going through a table tonight. Razor elbow drop driven down. Outside the ring now. He has no need to rush. Close fist connects. People realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Oh, 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 what a nasty knee lift. Dropping the bow. Corey, what in your opinion makes the biggest difference in a tables match? A competitor's got to be able to think and move quickly, survey the damage, explore possible options, and execute accordingly. You have to take the fight right to your opponent. To put yourself in a position to do that, being tentative can cost you big time. You must get the table, set it up, and make your move all within seconds. Belly to belly! My goodness! Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Ugh, gets put into the barricade. He's taking some good hits. Sit straight into the barricade. Planning on what to do next. Oh my goodness, finish right in. Oh, this is not good at all. The pendulum backbreaker stretch. Oh, he retaliates. Counters on counters. Technical prowess on display. Oh, what a right hook. Oh, he slammed his face right into the barricade. Fisherman suplex.
He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. straight to the face. And now thrown back into the ring. Fishing for something beneath the ring. Oh no, now that he has the kendo stick, I definitely do not want to be in his path of destruction. Setting up for something here. Oh, is able to battle out of the grips to some safety. Saw that one coming. He's taking this to the floor now. Bam. Great reversal. Nicely done. Inverted scoop slam. Ooh. Watch this display of power. Sit up, Powerbomb. This match is brutality starting to show on him. Might want to start setting up some tables before this match gets out of hand. Driven into the barricade. He gets back into the ring. To the outside. This could get wild. Uh-oh. Look at this. Uh-oh is right. Fallaway slam. Well scattered reversal there. Uh-oh. Clearing off the announce table. This is about to go from bad to worse. This is not going to be pretty. I don't want to see this happen. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Set up for something in the corner. It's into the corner. Ouch. He may be in a bad way here. They have tried their hardest to avoid damage, but I think the table might be coming into play sooner rather than later. Oh, saw it coming. And he gets delivered back into the ring. He's got him here. He's got him up. And, oh. and more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. And this match will head back to the ring. Forks the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. What a rift club suplex. He went right into that turnbuckle. Knife edge chop. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Systematic attack on that arm. Dangerous position with your feet tied up like that. Ah, he's got that boot right up against his face. Come on.
Now let's get another look at some of the high points of that one. Here is your winner, Thomas.